lose the real power. A lot of money, like kind that me and you will never know. That's the only thing that makes the world go round. beautiful world. We've come so far. We just in a like a tier of civilians you know, population. We're just in a tier of population that just doesn't doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We've got no just so far from the where the actual progress happens we just we can scurry around as much as we want and create turmoil and chaos we saw little circles under a big line and then above that line there's other lines of the, of the other tiers but we were at the bottom and just running round like fucking headless chickens vehemently opposed with our political fucking views that had just hung out to us and branded and advertised to us in a way that will divide us to create like to help to help power the fundamental machine that is you know giving us the illusion of choice it doesn't matter what we do it doesn't matter what we do even people's hoist you know rare that you get to a certain level but some do but what do you have to give what do you have to give what do you have to lose this is where humanity's come to this is what well a certain slice anyway This road was longer, but I've got to really pay attention now. I mean, down the line, so. It isn't even anything new. It's not something we didn't know before. But it's just getting. Isn't it getting worse? Isn't it? It's getting worse, isn't it? It seems like. No, there's got to be an end to this, you know, if you've got a system and it's got a certain amount of, you know, content, data, money, currency, like, whatever. If, if it keeps getting depleted, everybody's putting in, everybody's working. And then the higher guys, they're, they're not putting it back. They're not putting it back, they're taking it and they're fucking keeping it for themselves. That's what's fucking up the economies. That's what's making all the fucking issues, so our little arguments between each other because we're worrying about our own lives. That's what it's all about. That's what it's... They know. They know what they're doing. They know what they're doing. And it's getting worse and it's getting to a fucking point where, you know, you can't keep taking something out of a finite system 
forever, it's gonna come to a fucking peak. Something is fucking gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. Some, like, the world's been changing for a long time. We've had the Industrial Revolution, obviously. The last 200, 250 years, humanity has come on fucking amazing. You know, the progress, the positive progress that he's made is amazing. But obviously, underneath all of that, there's underlying agendas. And I'm trying not to use like trigger words like, because people say agendas. And it's dangerous, man, because you can't say certain words. The moment you say certain stuff, people just negate your argument. And that's the power of the word conspiracy theory. Because if you ever think outside the line, it's an easy bucket to throw something into, and it's fucking dangerous. It's it's fucking making our fucking ideas impotent. It's it's. <sighs> we need to come together, but we can't because we don't know how to. All we used to is fucking opinions, arguments, division and it's it's one of the big tools that's driving us apart that's enabling them to to continue doing what they're doing since what was it 2008 the fucking banking crisis the crash what guidelines have you put into place to make sure that hasn't happened again absolutely nothing I'm I'm, I couldn't manage a company for shit. I'm, I'm a, I'm a dumbass fucker. Up. But that's wrong, isn't it? That's wrong. That's not, you know. They enable. They still took their fucking bonuses while the country was just deflating, getting, just losing power. I don't know, it's, it's the, it's. Currency is the only economic, is the power, is the econ, is the system in place, economic. So I've got to talk in these terms, is my point really, because I hate money. I don't really like the value of money, but that is the value in this world. That's what I'm talking about. Why are they still allowed to be doing this? It's coming to an end. Something's happening. Something's happening. Just, I don't want to say trigger shit but look just fucking don't just listen to the the easy news i heard an advert the other day on a radio station it says ask your fucking alexa or whatever to fucking put this happy news on it's just another little thing like i, I think it's happening culturally too but it's it's extra factors and gears and cogs of fucking putting our heads in the sand and making it normal to not give a shit. To only give a shit about the small circle of you and your family. It can't have an effect on everything. You can't have an effect on everything. But we can't like this. We can't like this. People need to understand, man, and we need to come together. I can't think of what I want to say. I'm full of thoughts all the fucking time. You know, you could talk about underground bases and strange airports with demonic mural, murals of fucking horses outside and... It's crazy. I know it sounds crazy. It's, it's the, everything's crazy. Where do we come from? Why is our history not told to us? You know, why aren't we... Why is so much hidden? You know, Library of Alexandria, all this stuff under the... Under the, you know, the Catholic place, what's it called? I don't know. I've never sort of spoke to the camera or something like this so much, I guess. 
I'm trying not to, I'm trying to just free my thoughts and actually say what I want to say because I'm frustrated and I'm sad as fuck because we've come so far and we have done great things and we do great things together and that's what matters and being human being that's the most valuable thing you can experience and share with the world and other people is yourself you know your moments and your that's what should matter. We've been given a fake love and we've been stabbed with it and the world's fucking ill and people are driving it. should be put into place and all I guess I'm trying to say is if I even upload this it's just at least be a bit more aware of the things that are governing and actually um, shaping our futures because before you know it, it's like the uh, frog in the saucepan idea just just you need to find out for yourself because nobody telling you these big statement out there outlandish stuff in a sentence because they know it and they're impassioned about it it's gonna make anybody who's never got into it believe it because it's there's a void between there's just a void between that one sentence and you know the rest of what you know beyond it that's you, you, empowered you to enable you to want to say to somebody um, it's too clicky man, we've got to stop being clicky like we've got to share it with fucking love because that's the tr new paradigm we can't be them sheep it's us we can't be fucking because we don't draw that line it's, we're still us if you draw that line you're as bad as everybody else uh, no as bad as the, the, the dividers in the first place so it's got to be born out of love and we've got to fucking do it together we've got to it's, it's, it's the age of the combustion engines going and we've got to elegantly extract power from the fucking world now it, it's, there's no fighting anymore there's a more elegant way and there's a more elegant system and the future has got to be based on the foundations of love and i know i've got fucking long hair and i know i'm driving in my camper van and i know i'm got red eye because I'm a little bit you know emotional and it's probably cliche but I know it sounds cliche just fucking I don't want to say wake up man because this woke thing has been hijacked man anything any title any sense can be hijacked so fucking easy what you think something is for a second can turn into something else and there's true fundamentals that are unbroken throughout calmness for other people's opinions, love, openness to trust and to be trusted, willingness to forgive, compromise for progress. It's not about money. The value is us, all of us. So We've got to be all of us brave and we've got to be the big humans in the situation. Take a deep breath, swallow your fucking pride. We can move forward together. We can move forward together. There's, there's way more that makes us the same than there is that divides us. We've just got to refocus our attentions and be aware that people are trying to force it to a certain way. Sounds para. There's nothing more I can do, it's down to you. <laughs> or not. I know I think about this shit too much, but just imagine what we could do.
Imagine what they could do. The main part of my gripe, obviously, that I missed, and there's many more facets, obviously, that are valid, but we spend more money on, on like, war and killing each other, and, and I'm on about humanity as a whole moving forward, and I do realise I'm from a position of, of, of privilege. I, I, I do realise it in the world. Obviously, there's fucking levels. I don't think I'm a white thing. Everybody's born into how they are. I'm not ashamed of being white. I'm not ashamed of being English or British. I, nobody should be ashamed of who they are. I'm not a nationalist in the fucking slightest. And I think it is. it does hold us back. Things like that, and I do, it's weird because I do sort of like the idea of like a fucking united world, obviously, and like a world order almost. But if 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 that was the plan all along, and they were doing it for a positive thing, how far bad can good go before it's evil? You can't just act how you want and not affect other people and have a view a, another perspective on the situation that you're the fucking bad guys. I do understand. Um, of you know, I've now I've got such a loving family, and my perspective is from a position that not everybody in the world shares. I do understand. I swear, I try and be open-minded about anything and everything, and and I try and love everybody and be calm. There's so much shit going on in the world. It really needs to be dealt with. It really needs to be dealt with, and we're at this time. In our civilization, you know, there's some amazing things happening in the future with technology, you know, quantum computers and metamaterials and everything, you know, new battery, whatever. There's so you know, and space faring, oh man, but you can have good goals, but to be truly good, you've got to get there with every step being good. You can't. Fuck it up. If you that, you've got a responsibility. Everybody's got a responsibility to be good and better and help everyone move forward. We shouldn't be bombing. We shouldn't be killing. We shouldn't be hating each other because of different thoughts about gods or or teams or it's. There's more we can be doing. Imagine what we could do with that energy. I'm missing loads of points. There's too many points to talk about because that's the fucking complicated world that we live in. And uh, and it's hard to, it, I'm not the most clear person when I'm talking. It's hard to understand concepts. I don't think I'm clever. I don't think I'm above anyone. But we all speak languages and this is the way I'm putting it across. I just, I just, we can move, there's, no, there's more power in love, enjoy all your experiences, be calm, be nice, be loving, we can, we need to come together, we need to sort the fucking problems out man, fucking hell, honestly, I just, who's got the answers, I ain't got the answers, I haven't got the answers, but there's so much potential. And unfortunately, there's so much seemingly evil and we need to use our brain power and try and come together and guide it in a different way. And that's just a top skin version. If I wanted to sound crazy, I could go, you know, but it's, it's dangerous, man. We're living in a dangerous world, just love love each other, love each other. Not don't fuck each other over, everyone. I've been like nearly scammed like twice in the past like year and a half during COVID and shit like. Whatever anybody thinks of that as well, you know, the perspective of the world is that we're in a big fucking thing. So regardless of what you think, you've still got to be humane on the level of the the average understanding. You can't assume that everybody thinks. Don't be clicky. We need to move forward. Yo, cons conspiracy people or whatever. Use your power. Don't be clicky. Don't, that's not what it's about. Otherwise, you're just like a fucking, you, well, you're just useless. Anyway, I ain't got nothing. I'm fucked. You've sort of got the bug now for talking, but I think I've said enough, so just do what you want to do. Whatever.
Porque 